Hello friends. In the previous tutorials, we have studied three unit. That is what is abacus and that is introduction to abacus. And uh, second one is what is abacus instrument. And we specially discuss regarding the teachers abacus. And the third one is the counting system in abacus, abacus by abacus instrument from 1 to 100. In this tutorial, we are going to study the two points to learn about the abacus. This is one is how to hold and operate students abacus. This is student abacus and first point we will discuss how to hold it and how to operate. Second in it we are, we are going to discuss fingering in operation of beats of the abacus. These are the beats of a, we have told in teacher abacus, this is teacher abacus and this is student abacus. So it is the same it is same with Lika. This is a bigger one, this is smaller one. And here are also upper bits, here are also, here are also upper bit and lower bit. Upper bit and lower bit. Upper bit and lower bit. Same units there. But students are operating this instrument. Now, dear friends, we are going how to operate it, how to hold it. This is my just uh, this is uh, this is the finger. This is the hands. You just these two fingers. This is little finger and this is the ring finger. This is little, this is ring. These two fingers should be do like this and this is the thumb. This will be hold. Abacus will be hold here like this. Within these three fingers. These three fingers. Little finger, ring finger and thumb. With these three fingers we have to hold the abacus. And these two fingers of the left hand. Middle finger and index finger will be used to operate the beats, operate the beats and this is the right hand and the right hand will use how to hold the pen, this is the pen, we have to hold it like this, we have to hold it like this and make it these two fingers will be open, these two fingers will be open, right hand thumb and index finger will be open, helpful for operating the beats of the abacus and by the of the right hand one is index and thumb these two fingers are used to operate the beats of the so both the hands are working and our left side brain and right side brain are working to calculate the mathematical sum in abacus now we say, I, I shall demonstrate you the how to hold it how to operate it in abacus This is student abacus. How to hold it? Uh, you take the left hand. Left hand. This is the ring finger. This is the index finger. This ring finger. This point will be just in line with the unit place. You just see. It. This is in line of unit place. And this thumb will hold like this. This is the holding position of abacus. These two. This index finger and this middle one will be free to operate the beads, upper bead and lower beads of the abacus and now this is the pen or pencil whatever you take this will be hold like this by this three finger little finger ring finger and this is the middle finger with this the, you hold the pencil or pen like this like this it look like this and these two fingers one is index one is thumb of the right hand should be free to operate the upper bit and lower bit of the abacus this is the now when we do count let us say one. One means it will be by thumb you have to upwards. This is thumb. One. Again two. Again three. Again four. Upward movement of the lower beads in the unit place we do it by right hand thumb. Right hand thumb. Right hand thumb. And when we, now it is a this is a position of four. When we going to the five, what we are doing? We are to down the, this four. We make it like this. This is four down and five will be here. 
so this is the unit place of the beads downward movement of the layer for beads will be done by the index and as well as this is the upper beads and unit place this value is 5 to down it to the horizontal bar we use the index finger this is index finger now 6 again we use thumb 6 7 8 9 by the help of thumb we will do up to 9 now we want to go to the 10 then what we do we make it like this and put it in middle in the place and do upward and downward this is zero position and to make one you bring this index finger of the left hand to the this is 10 this is 10 now to make it 11 you use this thumb to upward movement of the one then two then three then four this four bead will be upward movement will be done by this thumb and now 15 this is the 14 this is one this is four to do it is now in a it, this is number is 14 we want to make it 15 then what to do for downward movement of these four beads we use this finger then this is the index finger of the right hand we make it down then again the index finger will bring down the 5 so this is the 15 again 16 again we use this thumb 16 for 17 he use this thumb this is 17 for 18 he use this thumb for 19 he use this thumb now this is the position of 19 now you want to make it 20 then what to do just by putting the finger in these positions in the middle of this and 9 will be 0 now 20 use this finger left hand this index finger will use to move the 2 then 20 then 21 21 22 23 24 then 25 this will be downward movement and this will be used for 25 this will be used 25 then 26 27 28 29 then you make it like 29 then 30 then 31 32 33 34 you downward 35 36 37 38 39 now make to back 40 you make 0 again. then this will be 40 then 41 42 43 44 thumb is used thumb is now for 45 you use index to down it and to down it this is 4 this is 40 this is 5 45 now 46 you use again thumb 46 47 48 49 now this is the position so far we use this finger thumb and index this finger is not used till then yet now from 49 to 50 when we do you make by this two finger of the right hand thumb and index you make it zero like this and to make zero here you use this index finger this one this way and for 50 this finger will be used this finger this finger this middle finger of the left hand will be used to touch the horizontal bar bar reckoning bar so now this is 5 and this is 0 so this is 50 5 0 50 this finger is used here this finger this middle finger of the left hand is used to make it 50 now 51 again thumb will be used this 51 52 53 54 number 55 we down it then you down it this is 55 56 57 58 59 now for 60 you make it 0 here and this is 6 this will be used this index will be used 6 this is 60 and for 70 again this is 70 for 80 this is 80 for 90 this is 90 now 91 this is 91 92 93 94 for 95 you make it down and it will come 95 then 96 97 98 99 this is in 99 this is 9 and this is 9 this is 9 and this is 9 
this is unit place this is 10 place in unit place also 9 in 10 place also 9 so this is 99 to make it 100 to make it 100 what we do to make it 100 what we do we have to make this column 0 again this column 0 and in this column we have to make 1 so how to do by right hand using the thumb and index you place it like this here and this 90 will be this finger will be at the, this upper bit and this finger for the lower bit is just like this this is now 0 now for 100 what you do you just use this finger this is 100 this 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 will be like this this is 100 this is 100 again same process 1 2 3 4 5 then 6 7 8 9 then 0 10 this is 1 1 0 110 11 12 13 14 15 16 17 18 19 20 then 21 22 23 24 25 26 27 28 29 then make it 0 this is this two and it will be 30 similarly 140 for 50 this is 140 for 50 what you do just down 40 and add 50 this is 1 50 this is 100 this is 1 this is 5 and this is 0 so 1 5 0 1 50 so in this way we can use one more thing this this bit this is except this unit place all upper bits all upper bits 10 place 100 place 1000 place or 10000 place this bits will be operated by this finger and this finger will be except unit this one unit place this finger used for the lower bits this bits will be this finger this lower bits will be up and down by this finger only unit place for unit place thumb will be used for the upward movement of the lower bits and index is used for the downward movement of the both upper bits and lower bits this finger this right hand index finger is used to up and down of the unit place of the bits and in 10th place 100 place and 1000 place leftwards the left hand index finger is used for movement of up and down of the bits and this middle finger of the left hand is used for upward and downward movement of the upper bits except the middle place so these are some principles of the finger in the abacus.